It's beer o'clock on Radio Craft Beer. Today we've got a beer from Duval and it's a bottle of their Triple Hop Citra coming in at 9.5% ABV. In a 330 Belgian style bottle. Here's a look at the bottle cap. Let's get the beer out into a glass and see what we get. There it goes, right at the death, the camera focused. Here we go. Look at the smoke on the bottle opening. Typical, typical Belgian beer opening. Lots of smoke, lots of liveliness. Let's calm down on that rigorous pour. Let's go a bit easier. We got a three to four finger white head, good levels of carbonation. It's a slightly hazy straw colored ale. Let's get the aroma. Poor, oh, that smells wonderful. I'm a big fan of the Citra Hop myself, to be honest. It's um, it's got a really nice kind of lime stroke grapefruit, like a hybrid fruit of lime and grapefruit. Spicy, and then of course you've got that classic Duvel yeast, that Belgian yeast. It smells terrific, it really does. Uh, Duval themselves, they seem very excited by this beer. Let's, uh, let's dive in. Cheers. Wow, Stone the Crows! Stone the Crows, what a fabulous beer! Um, it's it's completely bending my palate in half. I seen the world's strongest man fold a frying pan up on YouTube uh, the other day. Um, I can't remember his name now. The, the the guy with the mohawk, the British guy. Um, I think he's from Stoke um, on Stoke on Trent in the UK. Um, he bent a frying pan and I just feel like he's inside of my mouth bending my palate like that frying pan. That's exactly what's going on with that beer. But at the same time, you get an initial burst of carbonation. It's like a rip roaring wheel spinning start to a Formula One Grand Prix with this smoke everywhere and this, this it's almost as if it catches you off guard. There's so much going on. Carbonation ripping my palate, um, almost a touch of sourness going on, and then that grapefruit mixed with lime flavours, a lot of spice, and a lot of Belgian kind of estery, yeasty flavours coming through. Terrific, terrific, terrific beer. Big fan, big fan. But what is so miraculous, marvellous, splendid about this beer is the fact that it is so, so drinkable. It is 9.5% ABV and it's drinking like a table beer. In terms, I'm not talking about alcohol by volume, I'm talking about drinkability, how refreshing and lovely this beer is. It's drinking like a table beer. Or if you want to really stretch your imagination, it's drinking like a lager. Terrific. That is a terrific thing to say about this beer. The drinkability at 9.5% ABV. Because don't forget, bad me. <coughs> it's very carbonated. Let's not forget. 
that's my, my track of thought. Let's not forget it's 9.5% ABV, so let's not forget you need a lot of malt to, to, to be able to get it up to 9.5% ABV. So, but by doing that, by adding more malt, you generally get a more sticky, a more, a more stout-like beer in terms of mouthfeel. But no, not at all. Not with this. Not with this. But you could say that about an awful lot of Belgian beers. The drinkability is incredible when it comes to Belgian beer. Absolutely fantastic. Yes, there's, there's a lot of white grape flavour coming through. White grape with spice, grapefruit, orange, lemon, touch of pine needle, biscuit malt. Tremendous. Absolutely tremendous beer. Um, this this is indeed my now favourite. It's been voted as the best triple hop ever. And I'm going to give you my two my two ch shillings worth. I'm going to agree. I'm going to agree. I'm going to say this triple hop, Citra, they do a series of beers called Duval Triple Hop. This Citra edition is, is my favourite. I've had a few of them. Can't remember the hops off the top of my head, but the, I will remember this triple hop citra for a long time. Good lacing on the glass, good head that's, that's kept itself nicely in the glass. This is a tremendous beer, let's rate it. 9.5% ABV, let's give it a rating. I like it enough to give it a stone the crows. 9 out of 10. It's a 9 out of 10 from Real Ale Craft Beer. Please put your comments in the comments box. Subscribe to our daily beer reviews. Give us a big fat thumbs up. Boom! And cheers.